My name is Vikas and welcome back to my channel called Cognition Learning Center for All. So friend, today I am going to teach you how to design a structural bridge which is called trust bridge also. So this is very important for industrial point of view and basically this is a CAD design. So please watch this video till, till the end. Let's start with the modeling. Go to file, new, part, okay. So we can see here, we can add a Wellman tab over here if it is not there. So we can just click it or you can check the dimension or units like mm and all. So go to Wellman, select front plane, sketch, normal, draw a line like this. Okay, select all these lines, make it equal, select smart dimensioning, give a dimension of 1500 mm, so it is out of screen, so make this visible to screen. Fine. Select the midpoint and this make it coincidence. Fine. Draw a line like this in four part. Okay. Select this all part, all lines. Sorry, make it equal. Smart dimensioning. Give a dimension of fifteen hundred mm. Okay. Select these two points. Okay. Make it. along y okay smart dimension give a dimension of 1500 mm in between these two lines fine there is two line which is not fully constrained so check why it is not constrained okay fine select these lines make it collinear now it is fully constrained fine Select a line, sketch like a zigzag. Okay, fine. The last one, okay, and we have a sketch. So draw a line like this another line okay select these two lines make it equal fine and along z axis great smart dimensioning give a dimension of 1500 mm fine Okay, so now we have a sketch, okay, select front plane, normal, front plane sketch on front plane, again. Okay. Select convert entity, select these two lines, convert, okay, line, draw a line and make a closed loop, again, the other end, fine, ok, 
नीचे गो टू वेलमेंट सॉरी फर्स्ट वी नीड टू हाइड दिस थ्री डी स्केच ओके नाउ गो टू स्ट्रक्चर मेंबर सेलेक्ट यूनिट और स्क्वायर बार और रेक्टेंगल बार एंड हेयर इट इज स्क्वायर बार एंड फोर्टी बाई फोर्टी बाई फोर सेलेक्ट दिस लाइन दिस ओके दिस नो सो वी नीड टू क्रिएट अ न्यू ग्रुप सेलेक्ट दिस एंड दिस ओहो अगेन क्रिएट अ न्यू ग्रुप ओके फाइन सो नाउ वी कैन चेक द इंटरफेरेंस एट द एज so now it's look good here fine okay there is no interference at the joints so it's look fine here now go to 3d sketch so it and hide the sketch one Now we have a 3D sketch. So go to element, structural member. It is already set. So select the sketches, these lines. Okay. Now you can see here there is an interference at the joints. So practically it is not good. As a okay, at this point we can see the alignment. of the structure member which is not good so we have to make this align in a proper manner so i did this scroll down as you can see there is an option called alignment so select this line now it is aligned okay so only the interference is there so we need to remove that so go to element so trim extend so we can trim the extra part or interference at the edge select this and bodies boundaries select these two uh, this also for the boundary okay now we can see there is no interference and now it is weldable at this joint so now it's good fine so we have to do for all the joints where there is an interference at the joint the same thing will meant trim select bodies to be trimmed select this and the boundaries select these this and this okay so take a close loop okay so now it is fine So we have to do the same thing here also trim just like this this as a boundary and this as a boundary this also okay so let's have a look check now it looks good and it is weldable now do the same thing over here also boundaries fine this and this okay okay and this also now it is good as we can see there is no interference now it's look good so next step would be mirror all this member to the other side so select a mirror plane right plane and a mirror command bodies to mirror so select this member this 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 and this as you can see it is mirrored okay so now we need to check the interference at the joints so so it look good but here there is an interference as you can see there is an interference of one member to the other so we need to trim this also go to weldment trim 
select body to be trimmed and the boundaries okay this fine okay the upper member also there is an interference so we need to edit this trim command and select the boundary also for the upper member okay now it's look good now there is no interference and it is buildable now so we have one side member is ready so we need to linear pattern for these members so select this all members and a, and I give a direction select this edge for the direction okay and the distance spacing you can say 1500 mm and instance so let left as a 6 for now and let's see what happen select body so we need to select the bodies of the members so as you can see here there is a 6 member adding as a linear pattern and actually we don't need that 6 member so later we will edit this okay okay so edit the 6 as 2 now it's look good okay so we have another side of member is ready in a structural design and we can say trust bridge design okay now go to well made again structural member all is set select these and this Okay, now we need to check the interference on, so there is an interference at the joints, so we need to remove that interference, here also, so go to trim, select the body to be trimmed and the boundaries, okay, one at a time, to select this as a boundary, okay. Now let's have a close look and see uh, so there is no interference now so do the same thing to the other member select this and the boundary okay great let's have a close loop okay fine now it's look good so again we need to pattern this as a linear pattern so select linear pattern command and select the direction first so select edge okay so it's look in opposite direction as you can see there is an arrow at the end so select the instance 5 and the spacing is 1500 which is fine okay so bodies select the member so as you can see the opposite side so click here make it reverse and now give six because now now it's look good and there is one extra member also so we will delete it later so let's see now we have a complete design for the bridge so we need to delete this part so go to insert feature delete body or keep body so select this as a delete body okay so we have deleted this extra member so now this is a complete bridge design or you can say a trust bridge design or a structural design so this is very good for CAD engineer or a design engineer also because we use structural design in an industrial point of view so this is very good for the basic learn about the structural design so save this part as trust bridge to a particular folder okay so hope you like this video so please do share this video to your friends and family and 
प्लीज लाइक कॉमेंट एंड सब्सक्राइब आवर चैनल थैंक यू